Praise the Lord. We're in front of 10 Downing Street, which is the parliament area of, of UK, where Rishi, Nanak Rishi, Sunak Rishi, sorry about that, is now uh, uh, brought in as the Prime Minister, and we're sharing a few words here in prayer and as well as the Word of God, and we're just praying that strongholds will come down all throughout the UK and throughout London. It is a really interesting spiritual climate here, a very, a very uh, just relaxed, uh, compromising culture. So we're praying that the God would awaken the hearts of the people so that they would seek the Lord with, with, with everything and, and the gospel and the name of Jesus Christ would be lifted up in the UK once more. Hallelujah. Praise the mighty name of the Lord. And we're not here protesting. We're not here, here in worldly means. We're here in the spirit of God because we love you and because we're contending with your soul. You see, the Bible talks about a, of a God of this world, a lowercase g God of this world, and he has blinded the minds of the people. You see, sin separates you from God. And as a nation, as a nation, we are in sin. And I'm not here to spread a message of fear. This is a message of hope. This is a message of love, but love warns and love contends we're here out of love today we're here to pray for our for our leaders we're here to pray for our prime minister we pray that god guides him during these times because we are coming to a crossroads in humanity where the decisions that are made in these next weeks these next months are very important very important uh, and people start to become fearful of the things that are coming on the world but you know there's a place greater than fear there's a power greater than fear and that is the love of God which is towards all of those who are in Christ Jesus amen Jesus has come into this world to display the very character and the nature of God and the Bible says this that while we were still sinners Christ died for us while we were still in active rebellion against God that's when Jesus died for us. But the good news is that you can become one of God's children by simply putting your faith in Jesus and then becoming born again by God's Holy Spirit. This is a message for Christians as well. Yeah, He called us to do this, to come out here, to pray for the sick, to preach the gospel to all creation, to make disciples of all nations. Jesus said, I will make you fishers of men. So this is a calling to the church as well. Anyone walking past today, Anyone who walking past who calls himself a Christian, 